Howdy champs, my name is Mohit and guys today I'm going to show you how to use multiple classes on the same HTML element. Now how many of you actually know that this is possible? Well yes it is, let's see how it's actually done. Uh, guys I'm using Dreamweaver CS55 and uh, also I'm using the HTML5 doc type guys. Right, so let's start. The first thing that I would want to do is I would want to change the title. So let me type uh, using multiple glasses on the on a on a single ID rather on a single element right and let's close the title tag up let me save the document and here go save uh, let me call it multiple classes right let's see how this can actually be done guys now guys let me uh, create an internal or an embedded style okay so we need the opening style tag and uh, in HTML5 guys you can actually skip the type that's that's fine and you need the closing style tag so I'm uh, gonna create an internal or an embedded style okay the first thing that I would want to do is that I'm targeting the element h1 okay and the name of my rule is centered alright and uh, let's give it a declaration so I need the uh, curly braces and then I'm gonna say text align center alright uh, since I'm going going to use multiple classes on the same element which is h1 I would need yet another class alright this time guys I mean I'm gonna use a class called let's say mm, dark red alright since it's a class guys I need to make sure that it starts with this full stop or a period or a dot alright after which I need to give it a declaration and the only declaration that I'm gonna give it is color alright and uh, the color that I've chosen is dark red cool now guys let's see how I can apply these two classes on one single element so I'm going to go to the area where I have the opening and the closing body tags because whatever goes inside is actually what is visible on the web page guys so uh, I have the h1 opening tag which also means that I should have a h1 closing tag and sandwich in between I need to write some text let's say I am heading 1 and if I were to click the refresh button you can actually see that I actually have the heading 1 in the design area but it's aligned to the left and the color is actually black uh, let's see how I can apply multiple classes to H1 all I need to do is I need to uh, type the attribute class alright then I need to say that I would want it to be centered alright not only that I would want it to have the class dark red as well so space separated classes guys inside inverted codes and if I were to hit the refresh button now you can actually see not only is the element h1 centered it also has uh, acquired the property of the class dark red so guys this is a very short tutorial but very useful uh, I know for sure that most of the web developers don't actually know this trick so guys I hope you learned something from this tutorial and I hope to see you very soon with yet another dream weaver uh, tutorial could be flash with action script 3 as well have a good day bye bye peace